This is my extra large full 29er propane tie. This is my Esker Hayduke LVS. This is my LaSalle Peak 2.0. This is a Fazari Delano Peak. This is my 2024 Instinct. This is my Ibis Ritmo Aluminum. This is the brand new 2024 Noli Chill Coating. This is kind of a one of a kind paint job, custom paint job. This is my new house Hummingbird. FB 140 29er from Yeti. Sorry, Econo AL. YT Capra is the 29, 27.5. This is my Nebo Peak. I've got my brand new Rascal here. What's up? My name is James. I'm with Thunder Mountain Bikes. And this is my Esker Hayduke LVS. It's a titanium bike packing bike with 600 millimeter chain stays, titanium cranks, and titanium bits all about. And that is the hot sauce I make. Wiggle Biscuit hot sauce. I'm Robert, and this is not the Biker Channel. This is my LaSalle Peak 2.0 upgraded, 2.0 B version. <laughs> version two, this is the LaSalle Peak. I'm running the Spoke X wheel set with the Onyx hubs. The transmission, the pedaling innovation pedals, the EXT shock, this thing is money. Hey, my name is Kyle. This is my Ibis Ritmo aluminum. I got it actually because of Mo and Hannah, and I love the bike. I absolutely love it, and I'm probably going to keep it for more than a few years because I spent a decent amount on it. <laughs> Hey everyone, my name is Brooke Summers. This bike is actually a really great Sedona Shredder. This is a Fazari Delano Peak that I built up myself. Uh, this bike is 130 rear, 150 front. I have front and rear DVO suspension. I am rolling on the forge and bond wheels. So one thing I love about this trail bike is how much uh, seat tube insertion there is. I have a 150 mil one-up dropper on it. Short girls, I highly recommend you optimizing for as much dropper as possible. It's great to get that saddle out of the way. What's up? This is Luke from Rigged Supply. This is my new house Hummingbird. Um, this thing has become kind of just my go-to uh, trail bike. So 120 mil uh, Fox 34 step cast, Shimano XT drivetrain. I run uh, Cushcore XC front and rear out here in Sedona. Able, uh, helps me run a little bit lower air pressure, like 22, 23 PSI. PNW cockpit. Um, yeah, 40 mil stem. I also run this with a 60 mil and a flat bar for XC stuff. So, what's up, guys? It's Joey from RE Bikes here, and this is my Superior Peak downhill bike. This is an all new downhill bike that we are making here at Ari. Uh, not launched quite yet, but you will see it very soon. We've built in a lot of different adjustments. We have two different flip chips on here. We have a brace here in the rear end so you can tune how much flex the bike has. You can also change your shock kinematic here with this different shock mount. Hi uh, everybody, this is my bike, an FB 140 29er from Yeti. Why do you like it? It absorbs all of these rocks with this uh, amazing uh, fork and it goes really fast so it's easy for me to roll all these rocks that are loose and slippery. And tell me a little bit about yourself. Well, um, I ride mountain bikes with my dad and my brother and um, as sometimes other people call me the future of mountain biking and I also look forward into my soccer career and um, biking career. Hi, my name is Thomas. I am eight years old and I ride a Yeti SB140 extra small. And why do you like this bike? Um, it's, it helped me a lot on really technical trails, but it's not made for much jumps, but it helps me a lot and it just absorbs the jumps sometimes and the rocks. Hi, my name is Celia. This is my Thai carbon fiber from Propane. It's my enduro race bike. We've got Spank 359 wheels on front and back with Kush Core. Got a sick DVO Onyx D1. Um, I'm about to put the 38 on here. This is the 36. Um, we've got the Topaz in the back. And we've got TRP brakes, the DHR Evo front and rear. The gold, gotta have the gold. 
got Spank Bars and Spank Stem. My name is Rob and I am the sales director with Bird Spokes and this is my new bike for the year. This is a specialized stump jumper. Uh, I've got uh, XO Crank, GX Access rear derailleur, the most amazing Axis reverb dropper post to install. No cables, all wireless, it is awesome. And I think my most favorite part are my Bird Hawk 30 wheels with Bird Talon hubs. My name's Ellie, I'm with Rocky Mountain. Uh, this is my 2024 Instinct. Um, yeah, super rad bike. We got the down tube storage now here, um, decked out with full SRAM spec on this one. We got SRAM transmission. Chris Oliveira from San Diego. This is a Reeb SST, steel full suspension, 120 mil travel rear. I've got it set up about 160 front, a little over forked. Hey, my name is Nick Prisby. This is my Hanzo ESD. Um, run a Fox 36 up front, 160 travel, uh, single speed. And Maduro brakes, not a lot to it, but she shreds. Hey, I'm Victor with Propane Bicycles. I'm COO of Propane North America, and this is my uh, daily ride. This is our Econo AL uh, in the olive color. We've got the, the Crank Brother wheels, SRAM suspension, Crank Brother stamp pedals in the uh, sweet oil slick, XX uh, transmission, which I know Mo loves. All our bikes are uh, assembled in uh, Vancouver, Washington. So cool thing about propane is you can put any part you want on your bike that we sell. So it's kind of cool. You can mix and match. If you don't like a certain brake, you can choose a different one. You can go from a super basic wheel set to our uh, top of the line Crank Brothers uh, carbon synthesis wheels. Hey guys, I run the YouTube channel Van Can, and this is my new Noli Chill Coton. This is the brand new 2024 Noli Chill Coton. Uh, so this is an updated frame. Uh, we've got a lot of changes. Straight top tube, of course. A little longer in the rear, a little slacker, a little longer reach, a little steeper seat tube, and one piece mono rocker link here. This is the 170 version, but you could also spec it as a 150. Noble TR37 29 inch wheels with Minion DHR2 max grip in the back. I've got the XT drivetrain, so XT cassette, XT derailleur. I'm running five dev titanium cranks with silver Dega pedals. Hey, I'm Gaspare from Crank Brothers, and this is my bike. It's a, a YT Capra, it's the 29, 27.5, the motocross edition, as they call it. Um, it's one of the first 100 and only 100 pieces for uh, uh, the launch edition. I have uh, Crane Brothers Synthesis Enduro wheels with uh, Industry 9 hubs. Actually, no, these are prototype, my bad. I just swapped the rear wheel and have prototype uh, hubs. Um, Continental tires, the new one that everybody's speaking very well about. I have the SRAM AXS, the old one, that one that you, you were liking in the past. So, what else? I have uh, Crane Brothers Highline seat post with carbon uh, shaft. Then I have uh, DVO shock and DVO fork. Little secret here, something coming up very soon, an uh, integrated solution from Crank Brothers, where you can find a lot of secret inside that can help to save your shred. What's up guys, Sean George here with M Plus One Bikes. Just a quick bike check. Um, this is kind of a one of a kind paint job, custom paint job. Uh, full XTR drivetrain. This is kind of the old school birds. Um, we are a bird dealer, but these are these are from like three years ago. So these things have held up for three years. If anybody has anything uh, to say about the bird spokes, these probably have 5,000 miles on them or something like that. I've had them on like two different bikes. Got a brand new DVO uh, Onyx D138 on here. I'm Brian Gong. Uh, you can find me on social media at the Gonger, but I want to show you my Yeti SB140 lunch ride provided by N1 Bikes. Uh, this is a 2024 extra large turquoise running a Fox 36 up front. <clears throat> I'm a push ambassador as well, so we're running a custom tuned push 11.6. Great shock. I'm a Shimano guy, so we're running a full Shimano XT drivetrain, SBD, and Shimano brakes. Derby carbon wheels, I'm sponsored by Derby. He's the forefather of all carbon wheels that we ride now out of Marin in my local area in Northern California. 
I have Ergon Saddle and Grips as my contact points. They're sponsors and supporters of mine. Race Face Stem, One Up Bars are great bars. Sticker.com. We do the crank decals, the fork decals, the frame decals. Hey, what's up? My name is Jay Reagan. This is a Transition Spire. It's my XC bike. Actually, not really. It's just a everything bike. It's got a push coil. It's got the upgraded drivetrain. My name is Ryan Martinez. Uh, this is my bike. This is my rig. Uh, it's a 2020 uh, Specialized Enduro Elite. I got a uh, the 38 fork in the front, uh, Magura brakes, MT7s, just regular shifters in the back and all that, oval ring, and um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Hey, I'm Nick Newhouse with Newhouse Metalworks. We make steel and titanium uh, mountain bikes out of Marin County, California. This is our titanium hummingbird here. This one features our 3D printed seat stay yoke, chain stay yoke, We've got our 3D printed dropper port. Uh, this one is running a full axis drivetrain, Fox 34 step cast, and a set of five dev titanium cranks. My name is David, I'm the CEO of Propane, and that's my brand new Propane Econo Carbon. Let's tell me a little bit about this uh, bike. Uh, I prefer to ride the RockShox Fog, it's such a cool, a cool suspension system. And I really go for the transmission because I like the sh how to shift those bikes. And uh, yeah, it really fits perfect with the auto shift system. And look at this, how smooth is this, the integrated cable routing. What's up, my name is Juan Cordobes and I have a Trek Slash. Um, it has a high pivot and I love it. <laughs> I like the stability through rough stuff like Coming into the corners is so much more stable than the one that I used to have before. Hey, what's up? My name is Carolina. This is my specialized Status 160. And it's a sweet bike. I got it last year and just been enjoying it. Hey, my name is Lonnie and I'm with Rogue Panda. This is my Niner Jet 9 with these super awesome Rogue Panda bags on it. Perfectly complaining this awesome frame. Guys, I'm Matt Hugenboom. I've got my brand new Rascal here. Um, yeah, this thing is, is amazing for these trails, you know. Um, all new carbon layup, 20% stiffer, 150 grams lighter. Uh, some of my favorite components on it, um, bike yoke, 215 dropper there, RW30 laced to a Hydra hub, of course featuring SRAM XX transmission in the rear. And then Continental Tires. Daker with Yeti Cycles. Uh, this is my 120. Lunch ride version, some of my own flair on there, but kind of the bike I decided to bring out for Sedona and all the fun stuff that they have to ride out here. Uh, yeah, I got a beefed up Lyric up front. Super Deluxe. Some sweet DT Swiss wheels. Other than that, man, it's just kind of ready to party. I'm Adam with San Udle Design. This is my transition spur. Got built out for the Colorado Trail this summer. Uh, kind of built up funky. We've got a Cane Creek uh, inline uh, coil shock on it and then funky but a sit up front 120. We've got a uh, SRAM brake, SRAM drivetrain and a uh, one up 240 dropper. And then of course the old man mountain rack carrying our mini panniers. Um, in Dyneema, and then a thousand denier Cordura camo on the sides. Hi, I'm Lindsay. I'm from Southern California. This is my Yeti SB140. Uh, it's the lunch ride. It's got SRAM Eagle, the Fox 36 forks, the 140 uh, shock in the back, and uh, it's purple. My name is Ryan. I'm with Propane Bicycles. This is my extra large full 29er Propane Taiyi. I just got the new DVO Onyx 38 on the front. It's at 170 millimeters, and we just slapped the Topaz on. This is a 160 millimeter in the rear. This bike is full 29er. Uh, one of my favorite pieces of this bike is actually the tire inserts, Tannis tire inserts. They save my wheels, they save my tires. Got the GX transmission on here. Yeah, it's an extra large, if I didn't mention that already. TRP brakes, 203 millimeter rotors. Riding a binary with some Monet bars. Uh, absolutely uh, amazing frame and uh, love it. My be all friend, all bike.
titanium lightweight extensions. It's just got a little bit more travel. It's just a little bit smoother to ride. It's uh, a little more yoked out and uh, it's just low and slow and never stop pedaling. Hey, I'm Sam Kemp. I'm from Salt Lake City, Utah. First time in Sedona. I got a Stump Jumper Evo with a 170 mil Fox 38 and X2 shock, 2024 updated one. And then GX axis drivetrain, some SLX, Shimano SLX four pod brakes. SLX also stands for Super Luxury Extreme. Hello, my name is Murphy, Murphy Pacente. I'm from Farmington, New Mexico. This is my bike, uh, 2023 Trek Slash. I uh, recently put on Fox 36 uh, Magura brakes, MT7s, and I have the rear on order Naval Nation. Hey, this is Tim at Reeb. This is my personal SST. This is our 120 millimeter rear travel bike. Um, so super fun, great for these Sedona trails. Um, mine's built a little bit more unique than some. I've got it set up single speed, um, which is super fun. Hey, my name is Connor. This is my Nebo Peak. Shock shocks repping, uh, XO transmission, drivetrain. Uh, probably the thing I'm most stoked about is gotta be these Maven brakes. Uh, I am a huge fan of them, crazy stopping power. Uh, if weight isn't an issue, like on an e-bike, I don't see why anybody wouldn't want these. My name is Jake, I'm Backyard Shredder. This is my 2019, I believe, uh, extra small, Santa Cruz Nomad. I just like everything about it, honestly. It's getting a little small for me now, but just like, just the bike in general is just so fun. I don't know, it's everything about it, I just like it. What's up guys, this is Scott from Versus Tires. This is my uh, XL YK, YT decoy. Um, great bike. I was uh, lucky enough to get the push shock and the Maguras on there. I love riding this thing. I also have the limited edition teal tires, but uh, this is my kind of daily driver that I freshened up for the show.